Hello guys, welcome back to the new video. Today it will be on uh, bearings. And... How many bearings are there? What are the sizes? And uh, can I get them in ceramic? We want to use ceramic bearings because they have lower friction and they weigh, they are also a bit lighter actually. And they say they are stronger. So I don't know if this is all true. If you look at the ceramic speed website, they claim a lot of stuff like it gives you extra horsepower. Uh, less service time and stuff like that I don't know if this is true but I am willing to test it so first of all we need to know how many bearings are in the scooter so let's do a count I already prepared it a bit and was pretty amazed about how many bearings there actually are in the scooter so I'll show you now so the most are in the gearbox so in the gearbox, there's a outgoing bearing. If you can reduce friction on that, that would be very good because then the wheels will spin faster in theory. Then there's a needle bearing for the center gear. And on the other side, there's also a needle bearing for the output shaft and two roller bearings for the input shaft and the center bearing. Uh, center gear so let's count one two three four five but because I use a torsion that's six so there is an extra one and the brace of the torsion so that's six bearings just in this part and then on the other side of the gearbox there's the kickstart cover, there's an extra bearing, so that's seven, just in the gearbox. So then we move over to what is what are the other parts. So attached to the gearbox, there's the pulley, and the pulley has two. I have some here from an old pulley, which I replaced the bearings on one time, and so that's two more we're up to nine now so nine and then we also have um, on the front side of the wheel the so the front wheel has two one here and one here this got upgraded from this is a modified hub in the stock there's one here and a needle bearing here but on this one it's two ball bearings so that makes it 11 and then I have an extra one, which is um, for the torsion in the front, so that's 12. And then you have the main crankshaft bearings, two more. So in total there are 14 bearings. Okay, then another thing, since we are now going to upgrade all the bearings, I weighed all the parts, like all the gears. Um, I can actually show you. Like this is uh, the modified Polini axle, which is hollow in the inside, on the back, and it has an extra bit for the torsion. And I have already the titanium bolt on it and the ring. So this is gonna be used. So how much does it weigh? it's 464 grams but my idea was since there are no gears on this thing I would like to have it made in titanium so if we could make it in titanium that would only be 240 grams 44 grams actually so we could save around 200 grams just on this axle and I asked the guys from Titanium Race Parts and they said they could make this axle 
for 300 euros so if you know the stock axle also is like 100 euros I could sell this new stock axle and for some bit extra I would have it in titanium but I'm not sure if I'm gonna do that because yeah first of all it's pretty expensive and nobody has actually done it so I don't know if it can actually like hold the stresses and I'm not sure about that but that would be very cool so what else do we have we let's continue the weighing a bit we have the this gear goes on the output shaft and this weighs 287 grams with this you cannot do much it needs to stay in steel because yeah it needs to be very strong but I saw a process where they do shot peening on it and that basically makes it uh, they micro polish it so so there is no flat so it's very very flat and uh, less friction they say so yeah you could do that but that's I don't know anybody who can do that uh, here locally so then we have the center the center shaft for the middle bearing this weighs 148 grams but here there needs to be pressed on another bearing so this is my my other bearing mo at the moment with another center shaft and in total that weighs uh, 285 grams and then the cover cover with bearings and the axle in it weighs around 750 grams so yeah also my friend told me I had a fucked up bolt so this bolt weighs 25 grams and this is for Minarelli I think I always use this but this is actually the Piaggio bolt and this is much lighter and narrower so this only weighs like 11 grams so I have to wait on the bolt and I found out the bolts for the brake and the oil still need to be bought also in titanium um, okay so I took out the gearbox I noticed these bolts so I'll have to order uh, two and see if I can get them in titanium new o-ring I need and then um, yeah this is the gearbox it's a uh, has a needle bearing and main bearings from Polini um, yeah so the, the goal would be to replace all these bearings with hybrid ceramic and then uh, see if the friction gets reduced in the gearbox also the bearings in the pulley there's two there's one in the top and at the bottom there's a needle bearing i found old ones i once took out of a pulley so i think those numbers will be the same and i can weigh them oh i got my jets back all the nitrous jets and the fuel jets okay and then these bearings too in the hub these are pretty tough bearings you can like they're not very smooth then also in the gearbox uh, on the kickstart cover there's a gear there's a bearing i started polishing the rate the radiator a bit and it's still the stock uh, outgoing axle now so i also have a new bearing for uh, outgoing but i'm gonna just weigh weigh the thing to see like because the ceramic balls are lighter so the i noticed that with the polini torsion i have already one ceramic bearing and this is lighter so now i'm gonna see how much the original bearings weigh and then document that i got my jets back for the nose and uh, 
for uh, the carp. I got the Kickstarter back, the nice one. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with Ceramic Speed. I saw they they have a page for motorsport, and I know a friend who already uses these ceramic bearings. So yeah, we're gonna try to get them. Okay, so this is the new gear that will be put on the scooter. It's a bit longer because I noticed that the top speed it was like not getting enough gear. So I'm gonna put this. This will make it RF 7.0. It's from Polini. I think it's 1539. And these are the old gears. I weighed all the parts for the album. And yeah, that's pretty much the update. So thanks for watching guys. See you later. Bye.